We are in a crisis, and it's not the economic crisis. We are in a crisis of complexity, and research may not be the cause, but it's right there at the root level of this crisis of complexity. From the beginning of the interactive industry, we, in the research community, have been like kids in a candy store. We've had access to all kinds of data, all kinds of analytical opportunities that had eluded us through the entire 100, 150 year uh, history of, uh, of media. And we'd forgotten that audience research during this, this new period of running around, kind of getting, getting the data, trying to come up with new ideas, we'd forgotten that audience research is not just a science, but an essential business process whose goal is actually the building of businesses and the sustaining of jobs. It's kind of like medicine. I mean, imagine the complexities of modern medicine, the glories of molecular biology, the discoveries of nanoscience, the, the, the inventions of advanced procedures. What if this got so complex that doctors didn't know how to do operations? They couldn't cure people. Well, that's kind of where we're heading in interactive media and interactive media research. How do we know it's complex? In October, the consulting firm, McKinsey & Company, issued a study. It's uh, an annual study that it does, a survey of 350 senior marketing executives worldwide. And I've got to tell you, it's a remarkable indictment of business practices pertaining to research. 80% of the marketers in this survey, 80% said they, use, they uh, do this year's media allocation simply by guesswork or by using last year's numbers. 50% of the companies that said brand building is important to them, 50% said they do not measure brand effects online. The most remarkable thing and hardest to understand is that 50% of the companies that are using interactive for direct marketing purposes do not measure clicks. This makes no sense. This is the world of marketers who are spending the budgets. The most prevalent complaint that they made, you've heard it, is I don't know how to measure it. But the McKinsey conclusion was actually something different. It was a stunning failure to measure is what they identified. Well, why? Why this stunning failure to measure? There are really only three conclusions. One is that all marketers are stupid. The second is, all marketers are lazy. And the third is that it's just too complicated to learn how to do this and actually make your businesses run at the same time. And I can tell you, having been a chief marketing officer of a $4 billion services company and having worked with lots of marketers as clients, I can tell you that marketers are not stupid, marketers are not lazy, so the conclusion has to be that we have made this too complicated. I recall when I came into the uh, IAB job, one of the, uh, the most trenchant uh, comments, one of the best pieces of advice I got was from David Bell, a wonderful mentor and the, uh, the former uh, chairman and CEO of the Interpublic Group who told me, here's your challenge, here's your goal. You're in an industry that has been owned and operated by digital natives. You must make it safe and welcoming for digital immigrants. 